Some nights, I'd be sneaking out of the big house to run to Nunu just like one of the children to listen to the tales from her homeland. The stories about the porcupines and the little porcupine girl that Nunu called Afri. It means, oh great hunter, we love you for your <coughs> soup. Your soup is always full of big chunks of meat from the bush. But we don't like to see you in your red dress, always stained with blood. In this village lived a very young, beautiful Kotoko girl. Her name was Efriye. They were all porcupines. Efriye. She loved her brother and her family so much, but most especially her brother. Their mother, Abnenru, was a powerful medicine woman. She prepared strong medicine from roots, plants, tree barks, you know, leaves, herbs. Though so she was powerful, and she saved many lives in the village. Anybody who was sick, whether it was your head, your leg, your stomach. Abnenro was there. She had medicine for you. The father too, Pesia died. He was a great warrior. Very strong man. Anytime it was war, he would always go to the war front and come back alive. He saw that when uh, a free year was born, he could see, ah, this small girl would one day grow up to be somebody special. So he named her Efriye. You know, Efriye means special. Someone who is born to see. Because of this, she was called Efriye. And the whole family loved her and protected her. <laughs> <laughs> 